Hi, and welcome to another My Kids Locker video by Victoria Wolders on Microsoft Office 365 Outlook, adding public folders. Today, we're going to be adding public folders to our folders. Um, so what you want to do is you want to access into your email, your Outlook, and you're going to go to folders. And what you want to do, if you're on a MacBook, please put your two fingers on the mouse pad. And then what you're wanting to do is you want to tap on the mouse pad with your two fingers. You're on a Mac. And it's going to say, add public folders to favorites. Yes, you want to do that. Once you click that, it's going to give you some options. Now, it's a little bit tricky, so you have to follow, follow the steps carefully. What you're going to have to do is you're going to have to add the folder that is in the most innermost part of the folder. So if you add just SD35, it's not going to show anything. So I'm going to go to schools and I'm going to add my school, but not only my school, I'm going to specifically go to notices and then I'm going to click on it. Whoops. I'm going to click on it and I'm going to go all the way up and I'm going to add to favorites. So I'm going to press that star. Try that again. Oh, and as you see on the left hand side, it just added. Now I had to do DPE notices because if I did anything above it, there wouldn't be anything in it, okay? So you have to make sure you try to go to the most innermost folder. I'm also now going to move all the way down here and I'm gonna to go to forms and procedures. Just say I'm organizing a field trip. I'm gonna to go to the field trip folder and then I'm gonna specifically add that field trips folder, okay? Now, if you, um, sometimes if you double tap it, sometimes it will actually say that they won't be able to add it because you've already added it. Just so you know, that could be a little glitch. So um, as you can see now, I am now moving down um, to other areas. You can see I can do join Pro D if I want to go, if I need to fill out paperwork and I can add that to folders and pop, it shows up on the left hand side. So all you're doing now is you're just adding specific folders, okay? So you can see that the three that I've added are there and once I click on them, there are notices and emails in there or documents, okay? So I wanna make sure that I add the ones that I specifically need. Anyways, thank you so much for joining us today and I hope you learned a little bit more about adding public folders. Have a great day.